everyone it's uh, 10 after 5 on Tuesday and this is my 157th video a closing comment on today's spectacular market uh, the Dow today was up 2113 points an 11.37 gain which was the largest in history displacing the prior gain of 936 or 11.08 percent back on uh, October 13th of 2008. Uh, the problem with that was that the volume was a little on the light side. As a matter of fact, it's the lightest day in a couple of weeks. Uh, and while the advanced declines were strong on the Dow, it was roughly 11 to 1 up. Uh, and on NASDAQ, 5.8 to 1 up. As I said, the volume was down. In the Dow, we had uh, 9 of the 30 stocks up triple digits with uh, UNH, the top of the list, up 175 Dow points, McDonald's 168, Home Depot 160, all the way down to the only stock that was down on the day, which was Verizon, down three uh, Dow points. Uh, the problem that I see here, and uh, as you know from this morning's call or last night's call, um, I felt like we were slowing the rate of decline and we were expecting a rally, or at least I was expecting a rally. Uh, and a rally is what we got. This chart is the S&P, and it's currently trading uh, 24.4250, and uh, that's up 222 points. Uh, it's actually up about $2.00 from where we closed, uh, and these being the futures, they trade for uh, a while, uh, another half hour or so, and then they reopen at 8 o'clock. Um, in any event, uh, my issue here is that uh, the other biggest gain, uh, that 11% gain back in 2008, did not mark the bottom. Uh, in fact, it took until the following March with a new low for that to occur. I'm just going to change this quickly, and you can see this is the area. This is a monthly on the S&P. This was the month that the uh, big move to the upside occurred, and it was literally uh, not until March of 2009 that we made a bottom. Um, I'm not sure that that's what's going to happen here, but I will tell you it would not surprise me to not be able to get through all of this uh, supply between where we are now, 2442, and uh, you know, less than 100 points up at 2510, 2500. So uh, you know, we'll see how we look tomorrow in the morning and with the uh, futures overnight. Um, but frankly, uh, I don't hold out a lot of hope here. Uh, I think that the uh, possibility of the uh, Congress and Senate passing a plan is, you know, 100%. They have to do it or they're going to get sent home in November. Uh, but I have a feeling that it may be a buy the rumor, sell the news kind of situation. Uh, the president and vice president tried to pump up the market and did so successfully late this afternoon, talking about how the president uh, wants to have uh, America open by Easter, which is uh, the 12th, I believe, of next month. You know, he can want whatever he wants, uh, but uh, none of the scientific information that's coming out in any way comes close to validating that kind of uh, a turnaround. Talk to you in the morning.